Today in Rift Spirits and Gear, we check out the all new Black Hole Reverb Pedal from Eventide. The Black Hole Reverb, if you could really call it that because it's a lot more than just a reverb, but for all intents and purposes, the Black Hole algorithm first appeared in the rack mount, some of the rack mount uh, Eventide uh, units way back in the early 90s, and then it was ported over into one of my favorite plugins that I have used for several years. And now the Black Hole is a physical stomp box with a ton of features packed into a fairly small enclosure. Now the Black Hole is a stereo output MIDI controllable 127 preset having reverb pedal that lets you do things from the simple to the very, very crazy and out of this world type of sounds. This is interstellar in a box. While you don't have to have it in order to take full functionality of the pedal itself, Eventide does have um, a device manager, the Eventide device manager, the EDM software, desktop software, that you can do all sorts of additional things with the black hole if you so choose. But I want to stress that as a pedal, you can use this right out of the box. It is very usable, but think of the desktop software as more of an expansion, if I may. Now, while other reverbs on the market have pre or post modulation, the black hole has modulation built in to the core reverb sounds itself. And you can use that modulation along with the low and high trim pots to kind of carve out and smooth out any rough edges or it adds some bottom end or something like that. This is really a pretty unique beast. Now, in addition to having five onboard presets, you have a freeze function and you can switch between the freeze function and the preset function while holding down the freeze button. But the freeze function is really, really cool because you can freeze a chord and then build upon that with other layers while having that base frozen part suspended infinitely as if you were a black hole. Now we're gonna go ahead and do a little bit of a playthrough. I will only scratch the surface of what this pedal is capable of, but nonetheless, we're gonna plug this in and we're going to turn some knobs. So let's go ahead and do a little bit of a playthrough. All right, so I am using my Gibson Les Paul standard into the Eventide black hole. This is my bass tone. I think uh, I'll be hanging out on the middle position for most of this playthrough. And I have the dials on the black hole set to noon-ish. Here we go. So currently I am in freeze mode and this foot switch allows me to freeze whatever I am playing. Now I'm gonna to try to do this best I can without using my feet since I have it set up for the camera, but you'll get the general idea. Thank you. 
Now, if I want to switch presets with my feet, I simply hold the freeze function and I can then scroll through the different presets. And in order to select one, I just hit the active button. Back to the first preset. All right, final thoughts. I can't believe they got so many features into a pedal this size, especially when you compare it to something like, you know, any of the Strymon stuff, which is very, very good, but no reverb pedal that I have ever played does what the black hole does. And I will also note, this is 279 bucks. This is a really, really good deal, in my opinion, for what you get, the really, the universe is limitless with the black hole. As cheesy as that may sound, really, you can do just about anything with this pedal. I will link down below in the description if you would like to check out the black hole for yourself. And with that, you've been wonderful, I've been Fluff. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. If you enjoyed the video that you just watched, please consider subscribing. It helps me help you and then in turn you get more stuff to watch. And also I have all sorts of stuff down in the description 
of this video. Sweetwater giveaway stuff. There's all sorts of links to all sorts of things. So consider uh, checking that out as well if you're gonna hang. But if you don't hang, all good. I still love you. <laughs>